In this video, we're gonna take a look at the new AI generative recolor feature inside of Adobe Illustrator, which allows you to instantly switch between color palettes on your vector art. This was previously released on the Adobe Firefly website, but Adobe just added the beta feature to the Illustrator app. The first thing that we wanna do is make sure our Illustrator app is updated to the latest version. To do that, open the Creative Cloud app and then choose updates on the left menu bar. Inside of here, if you see an update for Illustrator, go ahead and do that now. Once you're updated, let's take a look at how the new feature works. Go ahead and open up Illustrator. You'll first see the What's New screen, and at the top here is the Generative Recolor feature. Let's go ahead and open up a vector art file next. I have this poster design here for an example. First, you wanna select what you wanna actually recolor. I wanna recolor everything in this image, so we'll go to Select and then choose All. Next, choose Edit from the top menu bar, edit colors, and then from this menu, choose generative recolor beta. It'll then open up a window with the new recolor options with generative recolor. Inside of here, you can then play with the different recolor options. At the top, you can describe a color palette that you may wanna use. This is similar to the generative fill option inside of the new Photoshop beta. You just describe what you want and then hit generate. So let's say I wanna to stick to pastel colors. I could just say something like happy spring themed pastel colors. It'll then give me a few options based on the description of color and theme that I gave it. You can also use the sample prompts that they give you by default if you just wanna try out some different ideas. You could choose one of the presets and then try the different variations out that it gives you. There's a ton of different variations inside of here, so it's pretty cool to actually go through the different ones and see what each one gives you. You might come up with something that you weren't even thinking about that actually ends up being way better. You also have advanced options here at the bottom. Inside of here, you can include or exclude any colors that you want, say if you wanna build your brand colors, but you wanna try different variations out using just those colors. This is just another one of the many new AI generative features that Adobe is rolling out to its suite of apps. I have a few other Photoshop videos showing you how to use some of those features in there if you wanna check those out too. It's exciting seeing all the new features that Adobe's rolling out, and I honestly can't wait to see what they do next. And that's how you use the new generative recolor feature inside of Adobe Illustrator.